Hey guys, um, <clears throat> sorry about that. Um, I've got uh, probably just a few little ones to do here. Um, firstly, we're going to start doing um, regular expressions in Ute loops um, and how to actually do that. Um, you create a variable and a string to go along with it. I'm going to use um, I cannot wait for the new. Star Wars movie. Now, might be a bit nerdy, but um, now we're going to do x dot scan, like we have. Well, well, this is actually a new one. Um, we did sub last time. Scan is a bit different. Um, do the forward slash, and then we want to do just dot dot twice, and then close the brackets. Now, if you remember from earlier, inside curly brackets, if we use this double sign um, I identified as the OR because in Java programming and even in um, Ruby programming you can actually use it to say OR things. Um, so, but here we can actually use it to put um, values into the, uh, Y. And now if we type puts Y and close the brackets, and when we hit enter, what you'll see is I cat that uh, yeah what I'll do is I'll actually widen that out to three letters because it does kind of eh, okay it doesn't really work at all um but as you can see it's taken I space C so that's three characters space is considered a character in this up uh, in computers terms um and it's got all the way down to move and because there's no third by because there is no third in the um, IV there's no space um if we actually add an extra space there it would print out the IV but because there isn't it can't print out another three characters now what we're going to do here before we go um, we're just gonna do um, now, do backslash capital X bas Now, three of these. Now, what this will do is it will say as long as there are three non-blank spaces, so spaces that are uh, have a space in them or something like that, um, it will um, break it apart. So, what I can tell you here is it will say cannot uh, y for the new stuff st war move. Now, as you can see, um, I probably shouldn't have tried to read all that out, but it's got a little bit of it. And basically, if just uh, remember one thing, uh, the dot replaces any character, space or non-space, and Backslash S replaces anything as long as there is, oh, as long as it's not blank, it will replace it. Now, um, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, keep this page open, it's not going to matter much, but we're just going to do the same thing for the next few ones. I think I've got, yeah, two more parts so far ready, and I'll see you later.